day one of sectional wrestling tournaments, Division Three at LCC. Start 106 pounds. Alan East Lucas Freeman gets the pin on Jefferson's of Brett Molly. Move up to 113 pounds now in LCC's Hunter Lucas. Picked up some back points on Parkway's Reese Folkine. Lucas would go on to win for the T-Birds. 126 pounds, Alan East. Skyler Caprella take down an Ada Shaq White. Caprella would later get the pin and advance on into the next round. Staying at 126 pounds, Wayne Trace Rooker Glisten Lighter take down on St. John's Colin Fisher. Glisten Luter would go on to win. Move up to 138 pounds, Coldwater's Jordan Oberger against Ada's Xander Stewart. Take down for Oberger. He'd go on to get a pin. More from 138. Alan East, Luke Brown. Back points on St. John's Evan Pullman. Brown would go on for the victory 4-0. 145 pounds. Wayne Trace, Tyler Showalter takes down Jefferson's Jacob Harvey. Showalter would later get the pin. More from 145. Columbus Grove's Garrett Hollenstein pins Bluffton's Austin Malt. We'll stay at 145 for Alan East, Austin Tape taking on Jacob Durden from Van Wert. Tape with the back points would get the victory. 152 pounds now, Bluffton's Brody Basinger pins Jefferson's Cooper Chung for the victory. More from 152. Coldwater Cavalier Landon Schlotter gets the pin on Spencerville's Gage Bellows. Stay at 152 as Wayne traces Zane Cotterman. Gets control on Van Orp's Ryan Stoller, but Stoller would rally and get the victory over Cotterman. 160 pounds, Coldwater's Grant Kaiser taking on Parkway's Clayton Bolenbacher. Kaiser gets the pin. 170 pounds, Coldwater's Zach Klosterman taking on Bluffton's Dylan Pletcher. Klosterman would get the takedown and would go on for the victory. Finally, 220 pounds, St. John's Austin Schulte taking on Spencerville's Wyatt Crosscup. Schulte gets neutral, the only point of the match is he gets the one nothing victory. Take a look at the team results through day one. Of course, day two is tomorrow. Coldwater with an early lead. Grove Allen East LCC in the top four. LCC's Jack Huffman picked up his 150th career victory in tonight's action.